Disney. Fuck them all. Oh my fucking God. I just saw the most fucked up, amazing, uh, awesomest shit ever on Netflix, bro. Damsel. Oh my shit. I thought this was some fairy tale nonsense. You know, the usual shit Disney pool. But Millie Bobby Brown. Fuck, girl, you were amazing. Oh my God. I don't know if you have not seen Damsel. Drop whatever the fuck you're doing and... I don't even know why I'm cursing, bro. That shit was fire, bro. And there's dragons in it, too. Oh, shit, man. Oh, man, that was amazing. Ooh, it's PG-13. I don't know why I'm cursing. I apologize. I apologize. I'm just that excited. <laughs> okay. That movie, it's fire. Like, literally fire. Like, forget about the dragon. Forget about the story. Let's just look at the world building. The castles, the, the the cave, the fire. It was like lava, bro. You know, when you usually see dragons, the fire is usually just like fire from a, a dub. What is this? A fire gun. It just, it just flames. But that, that shit was lava, bro. You saw that on the door, on the throat of the dragon when it's about to blow all out. And it was oh, amazing. <laughs> Oh my god, I haven't been excited about a Netflix film this much. I'm just sweating off the excitement. God, you've done it again, Netflix. You've done it again. Take all my money and I'll never stop subscribing. I will never stop subscribing on Netflix. Man, these people are amazing. Forget about piracy. I will never pirate you, people. Netflix is the shit. God damn it. Damsel, baby. It's not your ordinary princess boo boo gaga nonsense. Oh hell no. That's not what this is. This here is about a warrior, man. A warrior. A small, intelligent, beautiful woman versus a dragon. That's fucking awesome. That's well thrown. Oh my god. The CGI on this thing, bro. Oh shit. Oh my god, man, this is amazing. I don't know what to say. This shit is dope, bro. Just dope. Man, I feel like they did that dragon injustice when they didn't put it on the cover art. Oh, man. Oh, my god. Oh, shit. You don't know how amazing this is, bro. This film, oh, one hour and 49, one hour, 50 minutes of it. Pure brilliance. Pure brilliance. Just amazing. Amazing. Every little thing. The ships. The, the, the gold. The royal wedding. The, the, the sacrificial ceremony. The fighting in the dungeon and shit. The dragon crushing, blood oozing. Dragon fire breathing, burning bats, buildings and shit. Oh, for fuck's sakes. This was amazing. This is the stuff of dreams. This is what I've been waiting for. I've been disappointed. I've watched tons of dragon shit. The last good thing I ever saw with dragons were Aragorn. That's the last good film that I was like, my God, this is good dragon shit. And then the following that was... Uh, um, you know, Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones had awesome dragon writing and shit. But this shit here, oh my god, this shit takes the cake for me. Oh shit, man. Netflix, fuck you. I fucking love you, man. That was amazing. Huh. Millie Bobby Brown, you queen. This is the most awesome... This has to win a fucking award this year. It just has to. And I haven't even spoiled it. Wow. What is this shit about? I cannot stop thinking about it. So this whole, the plot of this thing is some girl in a far distant kingdom is told that, you know, a prince of a far distant other kingdom is looking to marry a bride. And they, they choose her to be married to this prince fella. They have the royal wedding. It's amazing. And then the stepmother has this sort of a, you know, um, Angela Biscuit, if Biscuit, if I, that's her name. She has some sort of epiphany, you know, a mother thing, intuition. She's like, something ain't right, something ain't right here, man. She tries to tell this girl, like, hey, something ain't right here. And she's like, no, 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 my nigga, some, chill out, chill out, we're getting married here, we're getting married. Look, unbeknownst to them, this royal family has been falsely marrying their daughters or generations of kids. 
marrying them off to this prince, whatever the current prince is, mixing their blood with a little cut on their hands, you know, we brothers now, nonsense. And then they feed the girl to the damn, you know, dragon. And the dragon eats them because this fucking kingdom ate or just killed three dragons, three baby dragons, the last of their kind. Basically, this is the last bloody dragon. It's got no one to mate with, so it's alone. It's going to live alone. So it's living alone. And every few generations, it kills, or you just have for the fun of it, it just kills people, uh, daughters of this king and kingdom, bloodline and shit like that. So that's the whole beauty of it. And then, and then this damsel, Ellie Bobby Brown, shows up and just, oh, fuck, damn, bro, damn, indeed, woo, man. I don't know what to tell you. If you haven't watched this film, go watch it. You won't be disappointed. I didn't want to spoil it. I hope I didn't spoil it. All I'm going to say is, there's a dragon. There's a girl who's fucking hot. I don't know how old she is, but she's gorgeous. Who's kicking ass, stabbing dragons. There's, there's bugs that heal wounds, for fuck's sake. There's a prince. There's a queen. And the greatest thing about this, the stepmother. I thought she was going to be wicked, but she's amazing. Oh, my God, this is fucking dope. This is dope. This shit is dope. It's dope, bro. It's dope. Watch it with me. Oh, shit. Y'all niggas ain't, don't know shit. Oh, my God. I'm done with this. We're talking to top man. I need to watch that shit again. I'm telling you, that shit was amazing. Now that was entertaining. Please let us hang out yet another time. Remember to like and subscribe. Adios, folks. Adios.